I've got some swim tips for a couple of the newbies out there. I know the swim is probably the single discipline in triathlon that most people are apprehensive about. It's the discipline that kicks this sport off and all of us feel quite foreign in water. So if you are one of those people, some, some advice, try and stay out of the scrum, start to the sides. Uh, I know a lot of newbies who are apprehensive about the water tend to start at the back and to the side. You can get up close to the front, but start to the side. The reason being is you don't get caught up in that hustle and bustle of uh, you know, swinging arms and legs. Learn to sight, so it's important that you do do some swim sessions in some open water before you dive in for your first triathlon. If not, and you can only do it in a pool, learn to swim with your head up, what we call a polo stroke. Your swim coach should help you with that. Maybe do some sets of 25 meters with your head up, like a, as if you're a water polo player. That's always good for teaching your confidence in the water and understanding how to sight. But for most of us, staying in a horizontal position in the water is key, and I know you think, how can you not be in that position? But when you tend to approach a boy or at the start of a race, we tend to tread water with our feet facing downwards. That is what I call a non-safe position in the water. Remember, whenever you're horizontal, it's very, very difficult for you to be sunk and you're in your safest position. So remind yourself every 15 or 20 strokes to bring your kick in and bring your feet to the surface. Feel your feet kick the surface and that way you know you're in a safety position and no one can, can hurt you or get in your way. And uh, really try to relax, don't start too fast. Breathe every stroke. A lot of people like to breathe um, bilaterally. I find it better at the start of a race to breathe every stroke because oxygen is what creates, a lack of oxygen is what creates anxiety. So making sure you can breathe and have that oxygen really helps with that anxiety that we all have. And understand that the swim will be over. If you have any trouble, there's a lot of water safety out there, a lot of people there. You're gonna get through this swim. You're gonna have the time of your life. And when you're on land, you can do all the damage.